back again guys episode two rocky my body power ambassador t-shirt so outside the gym let's get started I'll get the glory. We'll win the fight. how's it going guys so as you can see we're in the gym switching things up for this episode two of my lean mass bulking series and i'm starting off with some gym footage Makes a change from just starting off with me talking in the car, but I wanted to try something new and just switch things up a little bit. So, majority of the footage that you'll see is deadlifts. Like you probably already know, I am trying to improve my deadlifts, my squat, overhead press, and my bench. The four big compound movements that I'm going to be working on anyway over the next couple of months during this bulk. So, this is deadlifts. This was back and biceps day, and I back on the deadlifts and I wanted to see where exactly I was in terms of my strength been on a cut for a while and it's expected you're going to lose strength so I wanted to just see where I was at so started off just doing 60 kg 132 pounds just to warm up and get myself used to the movement again it's, it's been a couple of weeks since I've actually done deadlifts um, then I started my working sets off at 100 kg which is 220 pounds and I just did singles just single reps and just Increase the weight by 10 kg, 22 pounds each time, working my way up to 140 kg, which is 308 pounds. It felt good actually. I, I was surprised that I was still had that much strength coming back off a cut for so long and only just starting to bulk and only just started to increase my calories because that's what I've been doing, just increase them slowly. So I've not been jumping up my calories, and this was a fasted workout as well. So I was quite impressed with the strength. Um, I think my hand placement could be better. It's slightly uneven, I feel, but overall the lifts felt good. Nothing next. I felt I was getting in the groove. No back issues. Nothing. And it's quite smooth. I'm not. Don't seem to be struggling while picking up the weight. So I was quite happy with that. Hopefully, over the next couple of months, I'll be able to increase it even more and aim for that 200 kg deadlift, which I'm going to be focusing on that's what I want to achieve on the deadlifts um, switching up sometimes as well I'm not just going to do conventional deadlifts I might try some sumo deadlifts I've had a little bit of a play around with it in the gym but not really not really used to it yet so I might might give it a try I might not but moving on with the workout guys I carried on with the back and biceps workout and did some lat pull downs and um, single arm lat pull down so I can concentrate on really just Isolating the lap basically and I am rocking my body power ambassador's t-shirt remember guys cheeky little plug Link in the description if you want to buy body power tickets So after I did that anyway moving on I did some bent over rows as you can see here I'm swaying a little bit. I was pretty exhausted by this point through the high volume of deadlifts and Didn't want to do too much didn't want to go too heavy so after that I did do some cable rolls and then I just moved on to biceps, keep it pretty simple with the biceps and just did some alternating dumbbell curls really making sure I get a full stretch to, on the muscle and then I did some isolated hammer curls like you can see here. That's basically the workout done. So concentrating on mainly the compound movements guys, that's what I'm going to be focusing on, more could call it powerlifting style and I'll see you in a little while. Workout number two of the series done. I am absolutely um, yeah, I am absolutely drained. That was an awesome workout. It took longer than expected. I've been in there for two hours, so this happens. But it was back and biceps, and I just set some PRs. I wanted to do some deadlifts, see what where I was at after being off for so long and. Been in a calorie deficit because I've been cutting. I wanted to see where my strength was at, and I'm quite happy. It was going good, so yeah, it took a little bit longer than expected, but oh well. And considering it was a fasted workout, so no food beforehand, I stopped eating at about 7:30 last night. Went to the gym at half 10 this morning. It is now about half 12. So yeah, guys, good workout. I'm happy. Can't breathe like Whew. it's red hot in here. So, plan now 
home, shower, get some food. I'll show you what I'm having. I'll check in with you in a little while. Finally time to eat some food, guys. So, probably seen me have it before. This is what I'm having. I'm having... It's one, one whole meal, farm cake, 100 grams of ham, one whole egg, and one slice of reduced fat cheese. That's what I'm having. So, gonna get that down, me guys. Got a little bit of focus. Yeah, I'm gonna get that down, me guys, and I've got a little bit of work to do on another video. So, I'll catch you when I'm having something a little bit later on. See you in a bit. Yeah, it's that time again, guys. Food time. Actually, really excited. Making something a bit different for you, give you a bit of different content. Why has it gone dark? Focus, yeah. So, making something a bit different. I've got 500 grams of steak mince cooking up there, browning off, just boiling some water for my bag of rice. And then, this is what I'm having. This is what I'm going to have. So this is what I'm having. So each one should have 1.8 grams of fat, 16 grams of carbs, 2.4 grams of protein. So, plan is guys, mix up the beef, add the seasoning pack, split it in half because I'm only going to have half it. Then I'm going to add my full bag of rice which is about another 70 carbs on top of that. And then mix it all together, add some salsa and put it in them. So that's all simmering away now guys and I'm not even going to lie, it smells amazing. What you do is when you've drained off all the brown meat you add this seasoning pack and then you add a little bit of water and then just let it simmer for 10 minutes and I'm not going to lie, it smells amazing. So I've got that, I've got my rice boiling away and these are the little cup things that you get and then my salsa. So um, I can't wait to eat this, I'm absolutely starving and it smells amazing. I don't, doesn't say what's in this seasoning but it smells awesome, it smells really good. Can't wait to eat this. It's done. So I'm gonna have it in. I'm only gonna have half it, so two servings. So now I've got to try and split it. So let's have a look. It's about half. Oh, this half. It looks more. So get that into my bowl. Add the rice. Add everything else. This is the final product, guys. Look at that. They look good. Four of them, got leftovers in a bowl as well, so that's it. <sighs> Worked up a sweat doing that, but I cannot wait to try them. Smells amazing, so guys, give it a go, make your own little, get the kits from supermarkets, easy done. And it's something different, don't always have it every day, so mix things up a bit, so that's what I'm having guys. and. I will catch you in a little while. So that guys is more or less it for the day now. I have just eaten some rice cakes with a little bit of chocolate peanut butter, nuts and more that I got. Um, that's set me up more or less for the day now. I will either put on screen, let's have a look. I've ended on 2,635 calories. 237 grams of carbs, 61 grams of fat, and 203 grams of protein. So I'm a little bit under on my fat, but let's keep it at that. Um, carbs are fine, protein's about right for what I'm aiming for. So what I'm going to do now is just slowly increase the carbs, keep the fats and the protein the same at the minute, and just, like I say, increase the carbs slowly. Hopefully that will stop me putting on too much body fat too much weight too soon maybe for maybe one pound a week maybe we'll see um
but that's that's the plan. Just slow and steady. I'm not in a rush putting on the, on this bulk, but that's what I'm going to do. Gym wise, I think everything's going to plan at the minute. I'm probably a little bit ahead. Um, strength's not as bad as I thought it would be after being cutting for so long. So quite happy. Um, deadlifts were good today. Can't complain with that. If you enjoyed the video, guys, don't forget to click subscribe down below and support the channel, support me, and like the video, share it, all the usual. Leave any comments. Dog jumping around. So I'll get back to you. I try and answer all all of them. I'm sure I answer all of them pretty much. Or you can contact me on Twitter, Facebook. Don't mind in the slightest. Um, yeah, that's it. Yeah, I think that's it, guys. So I will catch you, catch you in the next one. So episode two over. See you later, guys.